Previously on Next Top Superhero. You're not the next top superhero. Huh? We started with 15 of the world's best superheroes, and we've narrowed it down to three. Turning the world into chocolate one touch at a time, it's Coco Beware. The little shapeshifter who's a little bit shifty, let's hear it for Polly Mort. And finally, a lovely homemaker who will warm your stomach and your house, it's Shirley Burns. Tonight, one of our final three will walk away America's hero with the help of our judges. He's our resident scientist who plans to clone the winner. It's Dr. Tesla Eisenstein. The odds of a winner actually being the world's next top superhero are quite infinitesimally small, but I like a good contest. Straight from the silver screen, it's Alicia Amwa. I love you all. Thank you, everyone. Don't forget to check out my new romantic comedy, Buttercastles. The most skilled judge of things he could never do himself, the untalented man with an eye for talent, Samson Crowley. You're a bland and talentless collection of sales. And I always knew you'd make it big. Tonight, our finalists will take the stage for the question round. But first, they get one more chance to display their heroic abilities. Please welcome to the stage, Polymorph. <gasps> Is this a mistake? You can't have honestly thought it was a good idea to show up as a f Oh, hush. I think it's cute. Do that cool click-click sound. <gasps> uh, you had to sacrifice a lot to get on the show? Yeah, I had to find a babysitter. Luckily, my ma could help. Hello, boo! <laughs> okay, moving on to our next contestant. Uh, is she gonna be okay? Hello, is this on? Excuse me, can I get another mic, please? Um, and chair, please. <laughs> These powers are incredible! How did you discover that you had them? My parents didn't want me on the show. And then I got mad and found out I can do this. But they're here tonight. They've been much more supportive lately. And finally, Shirley Burns. You're a superhero, a housewife, and a grillmaster? How do you do it? Are there no health codes against cooking food through bodily expulsions? Oh. Never mind. Ooh, can I get a cupcake? Actually, methane is a very efficient and clean burning fuel source. <laughs> oh, oh, hello. Moving on. The job of a hero is to make the world safe from villains. So for this question round, let's find out what our heroes would do to promote world peace. Peace? Are you kidding me, dog? Look, as long as they're a Peace. Oh, I hope everyone had their ear muffins on. Oh, I know. Everyone who is good gets chocolate. And everyone who is bad becomes one. Well, that is slightly disturbing. I feel like I've been given a gift. If we gave out some more snacks, we'd have some more peace. And they're so easy to make. So those are the answers, and these are your contestants. It's time to vote, so call in now. We'll be back right after this. As our final votes are being tallied, let's hear our final comments from the judges. I would need to examine further the mechanism by which they produce these superhuman phenomena before I would consider myself informed enough to formulate any method of valuation of said contestants. I think everyone's a winner. I really do, including the viewers. But really, more importantly, I have a new calendar out tomorrow. Alicia with baby kitten. Honestly, if it were up to me, there would be no winner. A human weapon, a chubby kid who turns everything into a snack, and a woman who leaks fire completely and utterly pathetic. <laughs> well, lucky for us, it isn't up to you, Simon. Now, in this contest, the winner is chosen by you. I will ask you to brace yourself for the impact when you find out that 
this year's next top superhero is... Shirley Burns! Thank you very much.